Hey, what's up, guys? My name's Sean, also known as Mongoose or Zamongoose. Today, we've got a little gameplay. I just literally prestiged to Prestige 13, so I had no weapons or anything. And I've never used the SMG 9s because they're noobish, but I thought, you know what, I'm going to try them once singly. So I've got this one just single gun with a suppressor, and then I tried it with the uh, Akimbo attachment. Just to see which is better, because everyone's around with the uh, Akimbo saying they're overpowered and stuff, which yes they are. But you'll see in this game, I do quite well, uh, we weren't playing the objective, we lost. Which is not something to really put on YouTube much, people losing games, but let's face it, it happens. And I'd rather put real stuff up. I think I go about 30 kills to 16 deaths, or like 18 deaths. I mean, it's not great KD, but I only used the uh, FMG 9 silenced with a couple of predators and attack helicopters as well, but they soon got shot down. I'm using care packages as well, which I don't use, but as I say, I literally just prestige. I think I'm at level 5, level 6. And I've got to say, I much prefer the FMG 9 like this, just single with the suppressor on it. It's far more accurate. You don't use half as much ammo. So low the akimbo does drop them fast, but I mean look how quick these guys drop here. They drop equally as quick I'd say. If I had akimbos, they still drop but I've used twice the amount of, uh, amount of ammo. So this is just my opinion on them really and just I'm trying to I'm kinda of getting bored of Modern Warfare 3, which maybe some people can relate to. So I'm just trying new New things like I'm going on hardcore. Most people know I am a hardcore player, but for the purpose of YouTube, I'm playing COD, or should I say, learning to play COD. <laughs> and I'm just trying different uh, different things out, like running around just with pistols and just using guns that people don't use. Because I'm just I'm a bit fed up with the MP7s and the ACRs. They're they're like two main ones anyway. And I think I want to fire in this gameplay as well. Some of the streaks I go on should not be happening with a secondary weapon in my opinion. That's where I loved um, Black Ops, what they did. There was no like fully automatic machine pistols as secondary. I mean there was these, was it CZ27, you could fully auto upgrade, but even still it wasn't great. They just had pistols and your launchers, and of course the special ones. Which things what it should be, it should just be a secondary weapon. No point should you be doing what I'm doing right now, with being able to run around with your secondary how do people using primaries? I mean, I get lucky in this game a lot of it. A lot of it, I'm sneaking up behind them a lot of times, taking them out from behind. But, as I say, it shouldn't be happening, really. I do I do die a lot, but as I say, I was only using this gun and I was just running around like a madman, really. I was trying to level it up to get the akimbo, so then I could, uh, I was going to bring part two to this video out, so to speak, with the akimbos, but I couldn't get a decent enough gameplay. I went on some nice little streaks, I got like 11 kill streaks with them, but it's really bad games. And yes, this was on a small map of course, Carbon, I believe it's called. So, I mean, that helps a lot. Straight from the spawn, I find some room within minutes. But yeah, that's what I was talking about. Another thing I want to mention for those guys watching this, as I have mentioned in previous videos, I am a strictly hardcore player. But, as I just said for the purpose of these videos, I'm learning to play core. Which I'm not getting there, but it's, it's taken a lot of adjusting to be honest. And uh, oh, it's just, that was a thing. And um, I ain't a channel, as I've said in my descriptions, I ain't a channel for tips and tricks. I'll give tips that work for me, you know, I'll, I'll share that, but I'm, I'm not a tips and tricks channel. For those people that, you know, do want to improve, I'm going to leave a link in the description below to a guy called Blaze, Blaze is the channel, is the name of his YouTube channel. Um, he's on my Xbox Live friends list, I met him quite a long time ago through Xbox Live. Played a few games of him, a really good player, really fun guy. And a good player. And his channel is uh, full of really good gameplays and also really good tips. Especially from me transferring from hardcore to core, I've learned a lot from watching him and listening to his uh, tips and advice and you know watching how he plays and what he does. So yeah, I strongly advise going and checking them out. As I said, there'll be a link in the description below. Oh, missed it out. As I say, I was running care for Peter. I don't know why, they were just, they were just set up for some reason. I started, as I mentioned in my previous video, using the specialist now, but 
but you don't open up to rank 20, I haven't got it yet. So I'm just running carefully, trying to tackle in this one. I think my first is just Slight of Hand, Assassin, and Dead Silence, as I use the Stage Token for Dead Silence, because it's one of my favourite perks. I would have used it for Sit Rep if it allowed you to um, buy Sit Rep Pro, so to speak, but that's just such a hard perk to pro. I find anyway, and it is brilliant to use in a gaming headset to have it pro, but I may go for it in this prestige. Once I get to level 60-ish, every prestige, well, for the past two or three, since 10, I've already said I'm not going to prestige again, but hey, I've gone and done it again, so I mean, I've only got two more to go to late at 15, so I may as well just, um, just stick at it. Please do um, rate and leave a comment below, let me know what you think on the whole FMG9s, do you... I know the newbish but do you use them, do you like them, have you tried them singly for decent gameplays or do you just stick to the normal Akimbo's? Because I mean they are, they are overpowered, there's no doubt about it, but then again it's, it's even now because they're not very accurate at all, whereas the not PM, MP9, that's actually that, I mean you can run around with that and use that with a suppressor on or even extended mag use that as a primary weapon, it's got no recoil and it drops him rapidly. Which is nice to have as a secondary, don't get me wrong, but as I say, it's a secondary, you're not, you shouldn't be running around using them as primary. But this was just purely an experiment. Just for a video, really, just give my opinion on the uh, second V9, as I say. I do hate them, well I hate being killed by them, but they are just Another thing I've tried out in a private match, I, swear, I didn't really, I mean I will do a video if it won't be true, but that was going to test, because I remember in Black Ops, the SR-71, the Blackbird, that used to counter Ghost, so if you had Ghost and the enemy team popped one of them up, you'd still appear on the map, so I thought, oh, I wonder if the advanced UAV in this will do the same with Assassin, it doesn't, Assassin counters it. So, you know what I mean, if you run around with Assassin on and you're wondering if the uh, advanced UAVs can see you, they can't. Which I suppose is there in a way because it can be shot down, whereas Blackbird in Black Ops could not be shot down. Well, there you go, there's just a little tip, you probably already knew anyway, but I'm just experimenting with different things, trying to find new different ideas to bring to you guys. I'll speak the gameplay up at any moment now because as I say, I just want to show them that little streak because I want. But yeah, be sure to subscribe for more daily content. Thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a comment. Cheers, it's a mongoose.